Hello guys, and welcome back to a brand new Minecraft video. Uh, yeah, you'll remember in last episode, we went to the nether, decided to blow some stuff up, and ended up dying, losing most of our things. I still have a diamond uh, axe though, and I've now remade a diamond pickaxe with the four diamonds I had available. Um, I already, uh, I managed to get all my armor back, so at least we don't have, you know, non-diamond armor, but I am disappointed about the levels, which is a bit disappointing, but it is what it is. Um, but in this particular episode, um, I do actually plan on finally getting that fishing hut built over on the island over there, so we can do some grinding and fishing. But, for that, I am going to need quite a few things. I've already got a chest over there and a crafting table ready for the build, um, which has some spruce in it. Um, but I am going to need some more spruce, so we are going to have to do some more choppy choppy chopping today. But, we also need a lot of coal, because I need some campfires. And as it happens, I've just searched all my chests in here, and apparently I have no coal whatsoever. Um, which is rather annoying, because I've actually not been using coal for the purposes of anything really, other than the fact that um, I've been making torches with it and i suppose because i lost a lot of torches i've you know made a load of torches so with that being said i am actually going to go down to the mine now i'm probably not going to find much coal but we are going to start here just because we've probably got more chance of finding coal on this floor here um because i'm just hoping that we can just get a little bit of coal um, but i do intend to go mining again for the purpose of finding diamonds as well um, but yeah, we're just going to do a bit of a grind today, a bit of, a bit of sort of mining grind, um, just to sort of start the episode off. Basically, we're gathering the materials and building the fishing hut today. Um, and I might also see if we can go back to the nether to get some quartz and, and stuff like that, just to sort of build up our levels again, because it really upsets me that we don't have those levels. Um, because we had like 20 something, no we had 32 levels I'm pretty sure actually, um, and I was saving the levels so that we could do some enchanting and maybe get fortune 3 on our pickaxe, but that didn't happen. Um, I also, the, the pickaxe I did have, um, I'm pretty sure I had efficiency 2 on, um, the pickaxe I've got now has nothing because I've not enchanted it because I've got one level. I'm not finding any coal. We might have to go and see if we can find some mountains and do some, some coal grinding there. Um, so I think in the meantime what we'll do is we will actually head down to our mine. Um, where we can go and grind and get some diamonds. Potentially. Potentially get some diamonds. We might find some coal along the way. Who knows? There might be some coal that I've left exposed somewhere that I've not mined out yet does happen i do i do do that on purpose for this reason of when i've got no coal left you know that is that is what i do um but you know it is what it is got any on there no it's mostly andesite uh, anything there nope that's where the deep slate levels start anything there nope going back down anything there Looks like we did a bit of digging down here. This was the iron ore, wasn't it? So if we need any more iron, we can go there. Um, looks like we haven't got any left out anywhere, which is a bit upsetting. But hey ho. Level are we on? Level 23. I'm not sure why I find it level 23, but hey ho. Let's go down to the bottom where we were before and do some more my I just heard a zombie. Why did I hear a zombie? It's probably knocking about somewhere, Mr. Zombie. Okay, so we now need to continue this way. Oh, we took a torch out. Let's just uh, pop that back. Oh, 
Ooh, let's go. Gives us some XP. Got two levels just from mining that redstone. That's pretty good. All right, guys, so we have actually uh, just been mining. Um, I did actually manage to get another four diamonds. So I've now got five diamonds in total. We've got some lapis and redstone and stuff. Now, I can hear a spider outside because it was night when I came back from the mines. Um, I literally found those five, four diamonds, um, and then I decided to head home. Killed them for their XP. Alrighty then, let's go. So we do still need to gather the materials. Um, so I might gather the materials off camera, to be honest with you. I don't need much more than spruce wood. I do need to get some more spruce wood, but what I really need is coal. And as it stands, I haven't got much coal about. Just kill the chicken. So what I'd like to do is just try and go into some of these mountains up here. Um, just to see if I can find some coal. Just because then we can make the campfires we need. And obviously more torches if we need it. Um, plus obviously we get XP for finding it. So yeah we're just going to head up into this mountain here. Let's just double check. There isn't any here. Actually... I believe there's some down this cavern that we normally go down. So let's maybe head down there and just see what we can find or see. It's so there's any coal on this level up here that we have not ex found yet or excavated. I probably have left some somewhere. It's very dark over here still, which does annoy me a little bit. Oh, there is a bit up there. Let's see if we can get to that. Oh, I can hear a zombie. But I don't know where he is. Maybe he's up here. Oh! 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 I think we might have just found a spawner. While they're busy killing each other. Oh! I can't believe we've only just found this skeleton spawner. Iron. Okay. Some coal in here, which we need. Get some wheat, golden apple, a bit of string, a bit of gunpowder. Hmm. So, this is quite close to where we live. So, what I'm thinking of doing is potentially turning this now. Oh, there is a creeper over there. Potentially turning this now into um, a proper, like, XP farm. Uh, that might be something worth doing, so I think I think we should do that at some point. Uh, let me just get this call I actually came up for. Right, so there is now a spawner up there, which is absolutely fantastic. I can't believe we've only just discovered that after all the times we've been down here mining this same route. 
and we've only just discovered a skeleton spawner. No wonder we were always getting shot by skeletons down here. Wow. No more coal up there. Let's see what's down here. I know that there is a zombie spawner down in the mine shaft somewhere as well. I do know that much. Alright, so it's always a dead end down here, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, we'll go up, back up this way. Munching my meat. We're bobbing along. Right, let's go. We need coal and we need lots of it. We need coal and we need lots of it. We need coal, but we need lots of it. Enough for what we need. Ooh. Right, we are back down here now. Oh, that scared me to death. But we will take the ink sacks. Thank you for your sacrifice. It will be used well. Alrighty then. So, here's what we've got. Here's the current situation that we have. We've come down to our dripstone mine area. Where we have a geode that we had unearthed previously. We have a lava plate over there, which is what I actually used to expand our lava farm so quickly off camera. Um, there is a lava fall here, but we, we don't really need that. Um, let's have a gander over here again. It's been a while since we've been over this direction. Not really seeing much over there, but we don't want to go down there. Ooh, redstone, yes please. Wait, I can hear a zombie, there he is. Why do these zombies get stuck all the time? Really annoys me. Right, okay. Over here we go. Ah, oh no, hang on, that's going back where we came. Excuse my language. Gold. There's another geode up there, which is fantastic. Right, so it's not this direction where we need to go. Let's get this here. When I said fantastic or redstone, it wasn't that I was looking for redstone. Um, I did it because it gives good XP. So I wanted the XP from it. Let's just dig out this urn over here. This iron. Yes. Righty then. Oh, XP I've not gathered. Thank you very much. Really don't need the rotten flesh or the spider eyes. To be honest, I don't need the granite either. Right, let's head over here. Ow. And later. Boom. Oh, redstone. Good XP, although we have now got a skeleton spawner that we can use to get XP farms and bones, etc. So we'll we'll definitely see what we can do in terms of getting that going. Um, that might have to be a future episode grind. Some more redstone over there. Let's get this redstone. I don't even need redstone, but I'm getting it anyway. What we're now going to do is go down into this mine shaft and go exploring. Plenty of redstone, so we're going to get that just purely for the XP of it. Some more over here. Thank you very, very much. Go on to here. 
this is where my zombie spawner is and what I'm going to do is ah! darken it out so that we can get some kills in what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do that and go AFK right so it's been about 10 minutes uh, when I've been AFK so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to break this block and oh sugar honey iced tea I was I forgot about kids it's been a thing in Minecraft Okay, well that got us XP up a tiny bit, but I mean, it didn't really, you know, do it as I wanted it. So, um, yeah, so that's a bit of a pain. Right, what I was actually looking for is coal, which as of the moment, I seem to be unable to... Ooh, that's done. Thank you. Yeah, can't really go that way. Have to go that way. Yeah. Okay, can't go that way. We'll probably have to go down that way, but I've been down there before. That's literally just where I'm mining deep slate and rubbish. Okay, um, I guess we'll go on this way. Oh, redstone. Still unable to find all this coal, which I am a bit disappointed about, but I hope it is what it is. Okay, so what I'm actually going to do... Ooh, there's a baby slime. One second. Oh. Wait, how long has there been a diamond uncovered over here? Oh, we're taking it. We're just going to dig around diagonally, see if we can find any others. Don't see any others, but you never know. You never know. That's one extra diamond. Okay, so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to head up and I'm going to start doing my spruce tree gathering, chopping down the trees, is, all that kind of lovely stuff. Purely just so that we can actually start building this fisherman's hut. Um, and it might be that I just kind of finish it off camera. Uh, I also need to get some job blocks made as well for the, um, the, the new house we built. So... I'm going to be doing that. I haven't decided what jobs they're going to be yet. I might have some cartographers, maybe. Uh, maybe some more shepherds. Some more fletchers. Um, won't bother with librarians, I don't think. Maybe maybe another um, armourer, maybe. Ooh. I haven't yet decided. It's going to be a bit difficult going up here now because there's all these, uh, well, it seems to be raining. And on top of the rain, it seems like there's a thunderstorm happening, so. 
That's not good for us. Thanks for the haul. Graper. Uh, thanks for the haul. <laughs> oh look, one of our librarians. He actually doesn't even sell books, and this guy sells Efficiency 3, if I have 13 emeralds in a book. I actually might get that Efficiency 3, just to put on this pickaxe. Oh, what a lovely day outside. It feels so good to slip out into a beautiful, summery day that we slept through. Absolutely wonderful. Right, I actually don't think it is a summery day, because that looks like... Oh no, that's the sun rising, because the sun sets on that side. Alright, let's have a look at what we've got. So, my raw food can go in there. Eh, let's see what else we've got. The books are in. Yes, I only need one book. And is it you? It is you I need. Thank you very, very much. Right, so now all I need to do is head back to my house where my anvil is and put it on my diamond pickaxe and let's go book pickaxe three I'll do an efficiency three diamond pick oh beds ha you know where those beds can go don't you over in the hoose over here over in the hoose in the hoose we built in the previous episode in the hoose I don't actually know if we've got any villagers that are stopping in these beds at the moment, but, um, I mean, you know, we've at least got beds there for them to begin populating the village with again, which is fantastic, and we're going to get some job blocks in here, which is good, so I'm excited for those prospects, and I do plan on putting some more of these houses up here as well, and some further along there behind the library as well. With that being said, um, I think it's time I go finally get to chopping my spruce wood up. Let's see what we can do with this tree then. Get this spruce tree chopped down. Get rid of this one and then we should have enough spruce wood to build our little... Fisherman Shack. I ain't thought about what I'm doing with the roof yet. I think I'm just going to do, um, I think I'm just going to use stairs for that, I think. It's not, not going to be anything special. It doesn't really need to be, to be honest with you. Right. Okay, so I've got some spruce wood, which I'm happy about. Um, I need to get my stuff so we can breed up our animals. So we need some carrots, we need some wheat, and we need some seeds. Oh, I've got to get carrots. I knew there was some matter of forgetting. And killing these animals, so... Uh, just going to run through the cows and breed these up. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Right. Let's go take a nap in our house. There's a chicken there, but I don't think it's one of our chickens. I don't know why these guys haven't gone to bed yet. That's a bit weird. Alrighty then. 
I got a horsey. We still don't have a name for you, but we do need a name tag for you, don't we? Yeah. Hello, Pippin, we've not seen you for a while. Uh, right. Let's go. Spider that I can hear, so where is it? There it is. Hello. Oh! Run, 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 run. Lead them away, lead them away, lead them away. There was two creepers. There was a flipping skeleton. <sighs> Where's my bow? Did I lose my bow? I think I lost my bow. Need to lead them away from my stuff. If they're gonna blow up an all by mistake, they'll blow it up over here. And that's exactly why I didn't want them near my house. I don't know where the others have gone, but they need to be found ASAP. There was a skeleton, there was a spider, and there was another creeper. Shit! 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 This is scary. Scary when you've got creepers coming after you and you've got no boat to take them out with. Let's get a new bow made, I think. Ooh, right. Yes. Yes. Ah, balls. Right, well, they're all dead and the skeletons I'm not too fussed about because I can kill them quite easily. Not that I know where that skeleton went. To be honest, he probably came into the sun under trees and burnt. So, that is that. Righty up then. So, let's go over to our little island where we're building our little shack. Uh, our fisherman shack. Um, and let's just dump all the spruce wood in those chests there. Ready to build. Because this episode has been all about grinding, material gathering. And of course getting ready for this particular build. Then so. As you can see. I now have um, some spruce and some logs and, and things like that. So, the plan is to create the frame first, so that's something we're going to do. Now, it is only going to be a small shack, so, yeah, with that being said, let's get building!
right guys so i have finally finished building it there's still a little bit of sort of decoration i need to do in terms of like putting windows on things like that adding a bit of decoration around the outside um like i'm thinking of stripping some of the logs at the bottom of this bit here but the idea would be to sort of stand here um and you know and fish um but yeah no i am really happy with um you know everything we've we've built today i'm really happy with the the design we've we've gone for um i'm really happy with how it looks from a distance as well i'll show you that soon as to as to how it looks um but yeah for the most for the most part it you know it is done um so to to get in we just hop up here um i, I suppose I, I i would put a step there but it's it's probably gonna look weird if i put a step there like i don't I suppose i don't think i can but you sort of hop up into there and we're in here and then we'll, we'll have a chest here that will keep all us raw fish and our fishing rods and things in we've got a bed to sleep in when it's night time i might get a little scaffold in here with a bit of table and stuff um the only thing it does need in here now for definite is just some torches um and i'm just gonna do that by placing them there but yeah i really like what we've done with the roof on this um i, re I really like the roof design um so if we just sort of swim over here a minute the idea would be to actually build a little dock here eventually so that we get a boat to it over there um but yeah i love the way it looks from afar i just think that it looks really good and really really pretty um don't know what it looks like from this side over here but i do really like what we've done with the roof design it just looks a little bit different it, it fits in with the local environment but at the same time looks like maybe an older style of build like it's not something we currently use uh, let me just go over here so we can actually see what this looks like from afar yeah i love that and i think um you know with along with the skyline that we've got over there i think it, it you know it's looking really good um in that sense so I'm, I'm really excited by what we've you know what we've achieved there i think that i'm just going to go a bit further closer to it just so i can get a good thumbnail uh, been planning on trying to build for a while we've just not got around to it um so yeah i'm just going to head back over here now to our house um oh, there's a cow there that's not one of ours i don't think but we have got plenty of cows and plenty of pigs and plenty of chickens and sheep that we're breeding so we will be killing them at some point soon um but for the meantime i just need to go put all the wood back really so that's not our wood chest is it no this is our wood chest that's not wood that's dirt so we'll keep that out um Put crafting tables in there. Oh, I never put the. I was going to put sign in, and I've got the glass panes here, so I'll probably do stuff with them off camera. That's not wood. Um, yeah, that's absolutely fine. Okay, we'll just put the glass panes back in here. So yeah, that's basically all I've sort of got to do this episode. I think what I am going to do though is I am just going to cut down all this sugar cane in here turn it all to paper and then go get all my other paper that i think i've got lying around somewhere um and then just see if i can trade it with that um paper value just to get some more emeralds and to be honest less for the emeralds because we've got loads of emeralds but more for the sort of the x xp side of everything um just because obviously we are level 15 but i do want to level up so i can get better enchantments on our things so let's just head over to find this librarian don't know where he lives so i don't know if it's this guy over here are you the librarian you're the librarian let's uh okay we've leveled him up now and we've ran out um so he definitely yeah it's a lot of emeralds thing but he, he'll level up in a minute so we'll be able to see what his new trades are which will be fantastic there we go so he now send, sells projectile protection three which would be nice and for one emerald we can buy lanterns which is fantastic because it saves us using torches 
which we can save coal for other things and we can make more of these little lamps and everything so that's really exciting i'm so excited by that however with that being said um i am going to end today's video here so if you guys have enjoyed the video make sure you hit that subscribe button smash the like button and leave a little comment down below to show your appreciation and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye for now guys goodbye